Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Bimo from How to Geek. In today's guide video, I'm about to simply show you how you can actually stop receiving unknown numbers, messages, and calls on WhatsApp. But before we get started with this video, if you are new to our channel, make sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and without any further ado, let us get started with today's video. How to stop receiving unknown numbers, message and video calls on WhatsApp. In this video, we're about to simply discuss how you can actually block and remove the spam calls, notifications and messages and limit your account's privacy to as little as possible. So make sure to watch this video till the end. First things first, you simply want to make sure you have actually updated the WhatsApp application to the latest version. If you haven't updated it already, you can head over to your device's respective app store. In the search box, type in WhatsApp and if there is an update button, available go ahead and simply update the app to the latest version once you've actually updated whatsapp the next thing i'm going to do is to simply open it and the next thing you want to make sure is that you are logged in with your phone number or your account after you are logged in basically you could see that this is how the interface is actually going to look like now what you could basically do is from the top right hand side of the menu tab on the three dots and then here you want to simply go to settings now if you're on ios or iphone this option could be at the bottom of the screen you'd be able to see the settings icon which looks like the gear icon so tap on the gear icon to go to your settings page and once you are on your settings page what you can do is right here on the top you'll find a button which says account and there you can see privacy security to change number so what we can do is go to accounts once we go to accounts again you'll be granted multiple options as we said before you want to simply select the first option which says privacy now right here this is the main page right here you can see who can see my personal info such as if you don't share your last scene you won't be able to see other people's last scene so what you can do is currently last scene is set to nobody and if you want your account to be protected and private you could actually set it to my contacts or nobody if you want to actually make it public you could set to everyone but then we are going to learn how to protect it so i'm going to simply basically select my contacts you also want to customize the other option which is called profile photo once what this does is that it's not going to show anybody your profile photo which is going to remove the less likelihood by receiving spam calls and so on you could also set this to my contacts or nobody if you would like to do it as per your own desire you can also see there the about section you could tap on it and then set it to only my contacts else you could also go to the status and also show to my contacts and only share with some kind of people you can also see the read receipts if turned off you won't send and receive read messages read receipts are always sent for group chats or something at the bottom you also have the option called groups when you actually set it to my contacts only people who are not on your contact list will not be able to actually add you to groups so you want to go ahead and simply review that you can also read there it says admins account can't add you to a group chat will have the option of option of having inviting you privately instead else you could also go ahead and simply customize all of these options now the this, this is basically the only thing we could only customize there is not a feature to actually block all of the spam calls and then block a no number calls because that is not in the whatsapp feature the only thing we could do is limit our accounts privacy which is actually going to decrease the less likelihood of being attacked by spammers we hope this video was really helpful and if it did help you make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you got any more questions queries or doubts simply also make sure to leave them down in the comments section thank you very much for watching and see you soon in our next video